Are we together? So in five minutes, I shall be with you. project generally started um, in the October of 2021. Um, the, the idea then is to work with the partner organization in Asia State who are conduct, conducting entrepreneurship development uh, trainings uh, to support them to build their capacity so that they can also um, train and then also build the capacity of MSMEs on entrepreneurship and then also in the aspect of business development support services. We are, after the MSMEs have passed through the trainings, they will also have access to further business development support services to uplift their businesses. So um, the training is only about 40% of, uh, of the, the modular approach while the BDSS, we call it entrepreneurial ecosystem approach, take about 60% of uh, the modular approach. For this past uh, five days, it has been fantastic. In fact, I've been attending a series of training, but uh, DIZ training is one of the training that I can really rate uh, the best. I've met people from different organizations. I've met people with different, from different backgrounds, and I've met people uh, of uh, different personalities. I've learned a lot, the facilitation skills, uh, the content itself, the different energizers we had, and a lot more. Uh, and the big part of it is having uh, met different people from different backgrounds with different personalities. It was awesome. I've met uh, good people, I mean super facilitators that took us through all we needed to learn to progress in our careers. I think the experience has been incredibly awesome. Uh, the training content is fantastic. Uh, the facilitators know their niche. Uh, I've never had a training that is this detail. That is the facilitation guide and that is the content for the participant. And the uh, facilitators understand the topic very well. Uh, they do injustice to that. And the mobilization of participants with great question is awesome. Made incredible guys here with superior intellect that I cherish. I was uh, expecting to be trained to become an effective facilitator, and uh, so far, towards the training, I learned a lot. I learned through the processes of facilitation, I learned the difference between facilitation and teaching, and how effective we can be as a facilitator. I was thinking for the station just to come and tell them what you know, not reading the content. But I get to learn that you have to study the content, know the content, what the content is all about. You don't really need to be perfect in the area of the content, but you need to know the details of the content so that you can effectively pass it to your MSMEs. I've been a teacher, but uh, when I met with uh, GIC, of course, a total different because uh, the the only thing I knew was that okay, the style of teaching, which when I came to GIC, uh, GIC I discovered that it was broad, big broad in the sense that from the beginning to the end, you have to allow the participant to do the work, and in doing the work, you know, in doing is a very key word because when you do things by yourself you hardly forget surprisingly you know when i was um, coming for this um intervention i was a bit jittery because i was kind of unsure um, of the kind of people i've come to meet but funny enough i don't think i've blended with a group of people as much as i've blended with this group of um, trainees so indeed, it's been an amazing experience. It's wonderful indeed, one that I would not trade for anything at all. The trainings are fantastic. At first um, glance and at first meeting, you know, they, they used to say, first impression matters. You think um, 
you don't know the background of everyone but when we did our introduction i realized oh these trainees are good and we can work together <coughs> that doubt was not cleared not until we start exercises when i saw what they were bringing out initiatives they were bringing out innovation they were putting into the implementation or uh, a constructive criticism of the component of the module to make improvement towards bringing up the learning point, I realized we could go on together. I am being um, part of the first and the second batch, and um, you know, we have people with different um, characters, and I've seen all the kind of characters in this batch. I've seen the good, okay, let's leave it at the good. <laughs> so, but um, so far, so good. It's been, um, it's been enlightening. I have. I, I, I now appreciate every individual with their various um, um, characteristics. It's, 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 been a, it's been amazing and I'm proud, particularly proud of every one of the trainers here because I've seen hard work, I've seen commitment, I've seen zeal, and I've seen intellectualism in this field. And from the little time I've spent with the class, I, I, just like I mentioned to you, the, the way the, the show of the enthusiasm from the, the participant and then the the way the, the rate of assimilation of the participant was I was really impressed compared to the previous trainings we have had. I was even telling the CEOs at this time around some of you have woken up because I realized the previous trainings we had they were just presenting to us anybody that is available from from uh, the, the um, among their staff members, but because of the challenge over time, because most of almost all of us are learning, with as we are implementing this, we realize that if you did not present the best of your your staff, it's going to be a challenge to you. Are we getting it? Most of if you present four, and it happened that two out of four are not active members are not good in conducting training. You know you have lost out to already. It's only these two that will be facilitating the training for session for you. So most of them have realized now. Are you getting it? So the, the, the kind of people they recommended this time around, I was impressed. Then coming to also other partner organizations that we are not part of us earlier, the way, the rate at which the staff representative from this partner organization are, are picking up the approach, I, I was seriously impressed. And then I was even telling my team leader that no, we need to do more for these uh, people that are just joining us in the future. I was even uh, saying that there should be a deliberate effort to link this training to the future uh, activities that we are going to be engaging with, with, with this partner organization. Truly is a, a TOT train training of the trainers. So are, the organization is training me to go and train other fellows. But they are doing it in this unique way that is in, impacting in me another knowledge entirely. My prayer is that uh, they will achieve the reason behind this and God will also bless them to do more. To whom much is given, much more is expected. I know most of us are, are, are facilitators, we've been facilitating, uh, even if it's not uh, the GIZ pro, uh, project, we've been facilitating a lot. But I think coming here and gathering all this knowledge and experience will go a long way in helping us um, deliver well whenever we interact with our SMEs. And it doesn't just stop here. I mean, it's not all about the GIZ and the SME, pro no. I mean, this is a lifetime skill. It guides you. I mean, we've been taught, we've experienced what it uh, takes and uh, what it means to interact with adults and youth from this training. The, uh, I've been facilitating, and uh, maybe I had a myopic understanding of facilitation. With this training, uh, I've had a broader understanding of facilitation, uh, the techniques that should be used, especially the experiential learning technique. Uh, that's what we'll be incorporating at uh, further facilitation. It's a transition for me, actually. It's not the way I came here, that is the same way I am today. And also, passing it down to the MSME back home, I think 
My message to you all would be to, um, first off, make sure that you um, master the subject area. I'm not saying that you should be an expert, but try to at least read and have vast um, knowledge on whatever subject that you're going to be facilitating. Then let the manual be your guide. And I want to also um, employ everyone to be flexible and to ensure that you um, you follow the modular approach as far as the self training is concerned. There is what we call response to ability and liability. When you when you grow people and you train people's capacity to be self-employed or to be entrepreneurs, you find out that they will respond to their ability because they take action. As of today, from last uh, December last year up to this moment, MSM is um, part, the seven partner, partner organization in Niger State have trained over 7,000 MSMEs in Niger State. The primary take home will be to go down and step it down uh, to whom much is given, much is expected. Uh, the GIZ Group has invested in us and uh, we're going to do justice, we're going to step down in our respective organization and in our various communities. We've seen your passion, we've seen your enthusiasm. My main message to you is that don't look at it that you are working for your PO, but look at it that you are working for the growth of the nation. I'll say kudos to GIZ. They are really perfect and uh, I love what they are doing. I love the humanitarian services they are doing. I love the impact they are making and I so much love if they can, if they will not stop here, also pass it down. So GIZ GOPA, um, the modular approach, as I always say, is new perfection. I have seen that um, if you look at this intervention carefully, they have taken into consideration every tiny details so that everything is all encompassed and it's, it's amazing. I want to say um, thank you to GIZ and Kupa for this initiative and um, for tolerating us and for supporting us continually. It's thank you for me. Uh, you guys are awesome. Um, uh, I don't want to be spiritual. I would say may God continue to strengthen you. Uh, uh, please keep doing the good job. So many people are benefiting from your trainings and your changing lives. You are doing good. You are the best so far. Thank you very much for this opportunity. I do not take it for granted. Keep the fire burning. Just keep it going. Yeah, the sky is starting to no. Thank you, GIZ. Forward ever, backward never. You know I want it.